it is Jess here with another review. And surprisingly, we will be reviewing the Power Rangers Dino Fury Dime Dimetrozord. It's number six, Dino Fury logo, ages four plus, Power Rangers logo. And right there it says plastic free packaging, Hasbro. Advertising the Zord link. And here's a beautiful illustration of the Zord. Top of the box, Power Rangers Dino Fury logo. Side of the box, beautiful illustration of the Blaze formation. Other side of the box. And this is showing you the actual sides of the Zord. Which is pretty cool, it's pretty neat. And then the back of the box here morphs, and it tells you that the key unlocks noises and all that stuff. And then it shows you that it can combine to make the fusion ultra zord and then the blazing megazord. And then, of course, the Electro Zord. Here we have the instructions. Then, of course, in the instructions show you, you know, how to put them together. For that bit, for what it basically is, the Dimetro Zord formation. And then, interesting enough, it has like this battle mode. I don't know if this came out in the show. I, I forget, it's been a while. I haven't seen it in a while. And then, um, of course, it shows you um, how to go about doing the Fusion Ultra Zord and then the Electro Zord um, formations. This is the key that comes with the Zord. Beautiful detailing there. And yes, the back opens up. And just like the other ones, it reveals a name. Here you have it with the other Zord keys. This has to be one of the most beautiful brick Zords <laughs> we have. It's an auxiliary Zord. But man, he, uh, he looks gorgeous. I really love the translucent plastic for the red, the orange the gold there, the detailing that's right there. Kind of sucks that there's no articulation in this. Um, but what do we expect? You know what I mean? I'm, sur I'm, gl I'm glad and I'm surprised that we even got this. Um, the mouth does have that articulation. It does open up. Like I said, I'm surprised that we even got this Zord and I'm happy that Hasbro released this. Um, I doubt we're going to get any of the other resorts, but look how beautiful this looks. I'm glad that they squeezed in one last Zord release before uh, Cosmic Fury. Oh yeah, and then the mask, this is the mask for the Fusion Ultra Zord. Looks beautiful, doesn't it? But he is one big, chunky, beautiful, colored, mechanical looking uh, piece of plastic, huh? <laughs> and here we have it in its alternate mode. I guess it's attack mode, I guess, or it's flight mode or whatever this is called. Um, I don't know if this was in the show, but yeah, of course, they give you these fist pieces. The shoulders with the blades. And then you open up the tail and then you got this mode. And again, beautiful translucent plastic with beautiful detailing in there. Looks good. Looks beautiful. 
It's awesome. Okay, here's the Zord with the other Zords. As you can see, he's the biggest one uh, if you exclude um, the three main Zords. As you can see, he's the biggest, most detailed one. Side profile there. To get an idea of how long this bad boy is. So he's pretty, he's pretty good size. And next we'll compare him to the main Zords. Here he is with T-Rex. Here we have him with Moza. Mosa. See, Mosa is longer than he is. Here we have it with the Terra Free Zord. Just for just for fun. Something about the red translucent plastic that I like over the blue. We have the wicked monstrosity that is the Electro Zord formation. Oh, this guy's hefty in this way. Look at this. Look at this monster. Look at all the colors. It's beautiful, like I said. This is why I love Zords. And I love robots. And I love big robots. Big mechas that come together to make bigger, uglier robots. Just beautiful. It's a beautiful monstrosity. Almost brings a tear to your eye. And here we have the Blazing Megazord. And naturally, this is gonna be a beautiful combination because you got the oranges mixing with the red and the gold and the black. Like it all just works beautifully. This is a beautiful beautiful Megazord and of course you use the key that it came with big old cannons which do need paint but you could go in and you can do that with the sharpie honestly if you so please if you choose to do that it's your toy do whatever you want with it yeah, this is beautiful. I might just display them like this, honestly. Just needs paint. Honestly, just needs paint. And here we have the almighty Fusion Ultra Zord. My, personally, my favorite out of the two Ultra Zord formations. I do love the other one. But this one's just a lot better looking. But honestly, they're both clusters, if you know what I mean. Look at that head setup. 
And something to note, this part of the mask, I don't know if you can see it, you see that gas? It won't shut all the way flush on mine. So hopefully you have better clearance than I do. I was gonna force it, but I think it'd break if I mess with it some more, but that's as good as it's gonna get on, at least on my Ultra Zord. As I said, this could do with more paint, but wow. Picking up uh, the Dimetra Zord is worth it just to do another combination with the Ultra Zords. You know, Power Rangers, Legos, robots, you can't go wrong, man. You get that translucent plastic doing its thing with the blue, and it's beautiful because of this blue. Um, obviously complements uh, the Gold Ranger Mosa colors with the blue and the gold. And then the red complements the gold and the red from the T-Rex. And oh my God, this is, uh, excuse me. This is just gorgeous. I give it two thumbs up, chef's kiss. Um, as far as I know, it's up on pre-order on Entertainment Earth. I don't know. It's probably on Big Bad Toy Store, but I don't know if it's live yet. I know it was live on Amazon. And I know you could find this bad boy uh, in your local targets. Other than that, I don't know uh, where else... <laughs> Uh, where else they might be. I don't think they're being sold at Walmart yet, but the Dimetro Zord is going for what, $26 or something like that. And he is an awesome auxiliary Zord to pick up, but yeah, pick them up. Have fun with your Power Ranger stuff. And uh, hit that like button and subscribe, my friends. And I'll catch you down the road with another review.